Hi readers, happy Thursday. Um, make sure to come to class. Um, it'll be better that way, but in case you missed our class, I will go over our lesson that you missed. Sad face. Okay, so our learning target is I can combine my background information and knowledge of the story to make predictions about what will happen next. Um, and so what we're actually going to do is we're going to go and um, watch a short story of the Three Little Pigs. Um, if you know the story of the Three Little Pigs, cool. Um, but this is the Three Little Pigs with a twist. And so the reason why it has a twist is it's actually going to use, if you have background knowledge about the Three Little Pigs, awesome, great. But if not, You'll be fine. Don't worry about it. And so what I want us to do is when we're talking about a prediction, a prediction is using like our background knowledge, the knowledge that we have that we're learning um, and making an educated guess on what is to come with the information that you have. So as we are watching this video clip, we're going to pause and stop uh, the clip at different times. Um, so if we're going to start off with making a prediction at the beginning, what I want us to think about is if it's called the three little pigs with a twist, what is a prediction that we can make? I'm going to stop talking for a second. You think about it. Try and make a prediction. If we were in a normal classroom, we would normally turn and talk at this time or in our live classroom, we're going to drop it in the chat. Um, but what, for today, what I want us to think about is when we're talking about a twist and it's a prediction, you're going to see it to be a slight change. The twist is like something abnormal, like a little, a little script off the road, off of the normal story. So if you are familiar with the story of the three little pigs, because there is a twist, keep in mind that there'll probably be some kind of change that takes place that does not happen in the original story. And we're not actually, let me just pause this for a second, because we're going to go ahead and jump quite a bit. And then you're going to see that I'm stopping and going at different times. So I think we're right over here. Finally, we're out on our own. Yep, I can't wait to have my own house. That reminds me. I heard there's a big bad wolf in the land, and he likes to blow down poorly made houses. Hmm, then it sounds like we need a plan. Pigs came up with an ingenious plan, and each went to his task. One built a house of straw, one built a house of sticks, and one built a house of bricks. And pretty soon, the big bad wolf showed up at the first house. So if we are to make a prediction, and they're talking about the genius plan, does the plan so far sound very genius-like? Let's go ahead and find out. No, oh, I'm so hungry. You haven't eaten in days. Wait. What's that smell? Yes. It's my favorite. A young pig deliciously wrapped up in a flimsy house. <clears throat> a little pig? Little pig? Let me in. Aha! He's finally here. <clears throat> Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Is he rhyming with me? <laughs> Fine. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. <clears throat> what? A trap? Fire! <laughs> Have a nice flight. Oh, why that? Okay, so just going off of the first pig, and if you do have any um, background knowledge from the original story of the Three Little Pigs, um, you would know that the wolf blows down the straw house, he gets a little piggy, he has a nice little, I guess, depending on the version of the story you're listening to for the Three Little Pigs, um, he has a nice lunch break. This is the twist because right here we see that the wolf actually gets um, sucker punched um, away and that the pig is fine. The, the pig was ready and that was the twist over here. So let's go ahead and keep watching and see what happens to the other two piggies um, and think about what predictions we're going to be making. So if we're thinking about next prediction, is this like the normal story? Nope. So what do we think will happen to the other pigs? Let's find out little wait what's that another pig yes i believe it is all right round two <clears throat> little pig little pig let me in right on time <laughs> not by the hair of my chinny chin chin more rhyming i'll tell you what i told the last pig i'll huff and i'll puff and i'll blow your house in <sighs> Thank you. 
It is not going well for the wolf at all. If we're thinking about the original story plot, this is not how it went. So the twist is still going on. If we can make a prediction, how do you think it's going to go for the third pig? Do you think it's going to continue on the same track? Do you think it's going to slightly change now? Um, do you think the wolf will be like best friends with the pig? What what it would what would be your prediction? So let's go ahead and keep going. <sighs> I think I finally got away from the... <laughs> A house? Oh, thank goodness. Hello, is, is anyone home? I'm pretty banged up out here and I could really use your help. I've been blasted by a cannon, stung by hundreds of bees, and I just knocked out one of my teeth. Owie, if you're home, could you please, please let me in? <laughs> Not by the hair of my chinny-chin-chin. Chin. Oh, no. You're not another one of those nasty little pigs, are you? I gotta get out of here! Not again! Wow, look at him go! Well, that landing wasn't so bad. What's this? A tiny bed? Mama, Papa! Somebody's been sleeping in my bed! If anybody knows about the story of Goldilocks, is it Goldilocks and the Three Bears? Yes, Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Just get a little vibe for it right now. And there he is! Well, well, well. What do we have here? Looks like Mr. Wolf has a problem breaking into house. No, wait, it, it's a misunderstanding. Oh, no. No. So I'm going to pause it right here, and for today's assignment, what I want you to do is make a prediction at what you think is going to happen next to the fox at the end of the Three Little, Bear, um, Three Little Pigs with a Twist. All we heard was the scream at the end. What would be your prediction? How do you think it's going to end? If you have any questions, make sure to stop by Office Hours. Have a great day. Bye.